Okay, so this is Iris. Iris is a Cambrian Shepherd. She's probably around 10 years of age now. She is a beautiful girl. No, she doesn't want to look at you. Um, Cambrian Shepherds are fairly active. Um, they have a very dense <coughs> coat, medium, dense medium length coat. Um, normally straight or wavy, as you can see. Um, they, the life, average lifespan is up to about 12 years on average. And they require daily brushing. We recommend monthly visits to the groomer. And um, they can grow up to around 24 to 28 inches tall. And Iris is just a big princess, aren't you? So what we're doing with Iris today? Um, she's in for a, a full groom. So we will bath, dry, give her a good brush um, and scissor, tidy up her trimmings. So like her skirt here, her feathers and feathers at the back and just give her tail a little bit of a trim. There we go. So we're going to get her in the bath. We recommend that this breed of dog has regular grooming at home and in the salon and has monthly baths. Iris is happy to have a bath. She will put her paw up for me to hold it throughout the grooming process for reassurance. I'm using a shampoo designed for dirty coats as Iris's fur is thick and dense and holds the dirt. The shampoo helps to release the dirt. We will always shampoo these kinds of coats two or three times. Iris is out the bath now. All nice and clean. She was shampooed quite a few times. Um. <laughs> this is also Holly. <laughs> who comes with Iris. So the owner has two dogs. <laughs> It is Holly's first time, so we'll see how Holly is. But she's taking it all in with Iris. Hopefully she can see how much of a good girl Iris is being. Yeah, yeah. As you can tell, Iris doesn't like being wet. Holly. <laughs> Holly, do you mind? It's really not about you. <laughs> She's sweet, isn't she? Okay, let's get this. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So you want to explain why you're on the floor? Oh, I'm on the floor because <laughs> it's easier and more comfortable for Iris. She feels more secure, doesn't she? Yeah. She prefers to be on the floor than on the table. So even if I do go home with horrendous back pain, Iris is comfortable. Eat it, baby girl, and that's all that matters. Yes. There we go. Holly likes the camera. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> Did you have mommy always taking photos of you? <laughs> you can tell which dogs are, <laughs> aren't you? Yeah. 
<laughs> they do like to go in front of the camera. Yeah. Do you want that one we had the other day? Yeah. The camera and she just Straight got away. away, yeah. <laughs> okay, Holly, you can be in it. The Great Cambrian Shepherd is a dog of great presence. It is believed to be the result of a cross between the Great Pyrenees and the Welsh Sheepdog. This breed tends to prefer colder climates due to their thick undercoats. They are a fairly active breed that love to spend time with their owners. Okay, so it's probably best to explain. Um, I have a shower cap on to protect my hair from the fur that will be blown out of Iris's coat when drying her. I'm wearing headphones to protect my ears because working with noisy machinery on a daily basis will affect my hearing without wearing them. The high velocity dryer dries Iris's coat and also helps with blasting out the loose fur, which that then assists with the brushing process. She's more comfortable on the floor. I'll try to do as much as I can on the floor. Keep her comfortable as possible. Okay, so because Iris has a thick and dense coat, I will use a few different types of brushes and combs on her today. So I'll use a slicker brush that's used on medium to long haired or curly haired dogs. That is to remove mats from the coat. I will also use a rake. This will help with, this helps to remove loose fur from the undercoat. And then I will also use a de-shedding brush, which also removes the loose dead undercoat without damaging the top coat. So just tidying up her feet, which she doesn't like. Iris, good girl. And flip it over to underneath her pads, which she also doesn't like, but she's being very well behaved.
Okay, so Iris is all done now. <laughs> no, don't come to me yet. I need, I need to get a video of you. So, hopefully, you can see a bit of a difference. Okay. You just have to look at the difference with her lying down. I mean, you can surely tell that she looks so much whiter now anyway than what she did when she came in. Let's see if she can show you her tail. She's so pretty. So Iris has had a bath, dry, a good brush. Um, and then we've scissored, I've tidied her up, tied up her furnishings with the scissors. And then another brush and another brush and some more brushing. And kissing and holding hands. Isn't it, Iris? Yeah. Yeah. It's not about you in this video, it's about Iris. There we go. Good girl, Iris. Iris took about an hour and a half to do. She didn't take that long. Okay, so it's the end of the day now. End of the week. Um, hey, Charlene. What? Guess what? What? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Monday, Sunday, when? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, it's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> yeah, 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 let's go home. I have no idea what that was. <laughs>